Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. How is everybody doing today? Hopefully everybody is doing well. Well, as you guys can see, I am doing a little bit of a different video today. This is a little bit different than a uh, physical media uh, type video, but uh, when I was doing my NECA hunting in the Target the other day, uh, I'm still in Wisconsin, by the way, but I was in the uh, Target the other day. Uh, they had a whole bunch of these, you know, uh, Halloween themed limited edition uh, cereals. And I decided I'm going to pick up three of them and I'm going to do some Halloween cereal reviews. Uh, like I said uh, multiple times already that I am full-blown Halloween mode. We're well into September. October's right around the corner. Why not just throw up a few, uh, uh, a few videos that are maybe a little bit different than what I normally don't do, that I normally do, uh, because it is Halloween related and I love Halloween. Uh, so these are, yeah, basically novelty cereals for the Halloween season, and I figured let's try them out. So we have, uh, Apple, we have Apple Jacks with Spooky Marshmallows, uh, It's the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown, and Captain Crunch's Halloween Crunch. You can see on all the boxes, they all say, well, this one says limited edition, but I'm, they're all basically limited edition. So we got three different bowls here, three different spoons, we got some milk. And let's get started. Uh, half the reason I want to get it too is because these boxes are really cool and I might want to keep them, uh, put them up in my studio. So I'm very interested about this one. So I'm going to try the Apple Jacks, which I'm assuming is not going to taste much different than regular Apple Jacks, but with uh, Lucky Charms type marshmallows in them. So I figured I'm going to open it up. Well, first of all, here's the box. We'll show it off there. It's kind of a cool box. It's got a creepy apple on it. Got the side there and the back is kind of fun for kids has uh little games they can play but a very creative very cool looking back uh yeah so this is going to be the first cereal that we try we are going to do the apple jacks with the spooky marshmallows you got the slime on there so we're gonna open this up and we're gonna see how these taste i kind of wish they didn't do them only in family size you can only get these in family size and Kind of wish you could get a little bit smaller boxes and apparently they make you work for uh, the cereal there we go Jeez. no oh, kind of kind of smells it's kind of got like a pumpkin kind of smell to it i mean kind of apple fall um kind of smells the way that you would probably think it was going to uh smell it's not going to take too much of it here because i have three of these i got to uh I got to try, and uh, we did, I did just eat not that long ago, so I don't want to go too crazy on this. But uh, yeah, it's got kind of a uh, kind of a fall apple-y, pumpkin, spicy kind of smell to it. I'm guessing it's not going to taste much different than uh, regular Apple Jacks. Oh yeah, and cinnamon. So it's the cinnamon I'm smelling a lot of too. So let's see. Yeah, it tastes exactly how you think it's going to taste, except for every once in a while, you get those weird marshmallows in there, which is kind of weird if you're not eating uh, Lucky Charms, but yeah, you definitely get the cinnamon, I can definitely taste the cinnamon flavor, um, but yeah, like I said, it's pretty close to what you think it's probably going to taste like. There's not really a whole lot of surprises. Um, but yeah, it's okay. Definitely not something I would buy all the time, but it's okay. All right. Moving right along, I'm going to save this one for last, because I'm the most curious about this one. Um, the, this one and this one, I kind of have a feeling, this one and this one, I kind of have a feeling what they're going to taste like. This one, it just says vanilla flavored cereal with marshmallows. Looks like it should be fruity. I'm kind of intrigued by that one. So next up, this is my favorite box too, by the way. We got the limited edition Captain Crunch Halloween Crunch. 
and uh, yeah, it's sweetened corn and oat cereal. Uh, ghost turned milk green. Ooh, very spooky. So yeah, so there's the front of the box there. You got the side there. And once again on the back, it's uh, like they got a word find on here. Just kind of fun little stuff for kids. Sorry, the light's kind of glaring on there. Hopefully you can see it okay. But yeah, it's a very cool box. A lot of a lot of fun for kids. I mean, let's be honest, this cereal is aimed towards kids, not 43-year-old men like I am. So that's okay. I'm gonna eat it anyway, because why not? Alright, so yeah, this smells like just standard Captain Crunch. This is gonna be very much, I think, like original, original berry Captain Crunch. But the thing that I don't understand is it says, turns the milk green. There's no green in this. So, ah, we'll see. But there's there's no green in this. So I'm a little bit curious as to how it's going to happen. I'm actually kind of wondering to see if it will actually um, turn it green. Oh, and it already looks like it kind of is, which is kind of interesting. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it's it's these little guys that have green in them that really come out. Uh, so it's these little guys that are hanging right here. It's a little, it looks like little devils or ghosts or something. And it actually does turn the mel the cereal, uh, the milk green. You can kind of see it on there. It's very green. It's kind of gross. But hopefully it'll taste okay. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, once again, no surprises here. This tastes like traditional, uh, traditional Captain Crunch, just with the fact that it turns your mouth green, kind of adds a little spooky factor for the Halloween season. But yeah, it's very, very similar to your standard, regular Captain Crunch cereal. Which is kind of what I thought it was going to do. But. But yeah, it's crazy. It definitely turns the milk like super green. I don't know if you can really see it in that. I want to spill it. But yeah. It's like super green. But yeah. All right. All right, guys, we're on to the last one here. That one's good. That one's definitely better than this one. But this one's not bad either. All right, so we got the uh, It's a Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. Like it says vanilla flavored cereal, uh, naturally and artificially flavored with marshmallows. So I'm assuming it's probably going to have a fruity taste to it. Uh, there's a bunch of green ones in here. I wonder if that turns it green as well. But there's the front, you got the side, and another fun little game on the back for the kids. So, all right, let's break into this last one here, and let's see. Um, I like how it says that. I got a rock. <laughs> I always like that. Let's see what it. Uh, see what it looks like. I'm gonna be honest with you. Out of the three, this one smells the nastiest. We'll see. I don't know. You can definitely smell uh, those artificial uh, marshmallows in there for sure. All right, let's see. Yeah, like I said, these two tasted pretty much what I thought. I'm a little bit curious as to what this one's gonna taste like I'm gonna add a little bit more a little bit more milk to that there all right 
And any of you that were out there wondering, the green does not turn the milk green. That one, it does. All right. All right, Charlie Brown. He's never let me down before. I guess there's a first time for everything. You know what it kind of tastes like? It tastes like kicks. They actually look like kicks. I think that's what it is. I think it's kicks that are just colored with marshmallows that are pretty flavorless. I'm going to be honest with you. It basically tastes like I'm eating a bowl of kicks with the different texture of a marshmallow because they really don't add much flavor. Maybe a little bit sweeter. It's basically like a little bit sweeter um, bowl of kicks with um, with a uh, with the little marshmallows like you would find in um, in Lucky Charms, but not with a lot of flavor. But yeah, that's exactly what it tastes like. A little bit sweeter kicks, and I'm pretty sure they are kicks. They look exactly like them, but colored. Okay, so out of all three of them, I'd say my favorite in order, it would probably be the um, Halloween Crunch, just because it pretty much tastes like your standard berry original Captain Crunch. I think the berry, or I think it's Crunch Berry is what it's called. It basically tastes a lot like Crunch Berry. And then my second favorite would probably be the Apple Jacks. Cause it pretty much just kind of it's got a nice kind of fall cinnamon uh even kind of a little bit of pumpkin kind of just pumpkin fall cinnamon apple flavor it's basically what i thought it would taste like it kind of tastes like apple jacks with some marshmallows in it that really don't add any other flavor other than uh what you're already eating and then these ones would be my least favorite although charlie brown is awesome this cereal not so much i mean like I said, it's basically a little bit sweeter version of, of Kix. Um, so I don't know if it's really worth it to get these for all the added sugar when you can basically eat Kix that probably have a little bit less sugar in it that are just not quite as sweet. So I'm glad I tried them though. But yeah, definitely Captain Crunch. Then the Apple Jacks with the spooky marshmallows. Although it's kind of gross, it turns the mouth green. And then I would say it's the great uh, pumpkin Charlie Brown uh, cereal. But yeah, uh, I, I thought I'd pick them up, you know, I was like, ah, why not? Let's do a little, a little Halloween spooky cereal review, uh, for the Halloween season here. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's all I got for today. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Let me know you guys like what I'm doing. Like, share, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And hey, let me know in the comments below. Have you tried any of these? Uh, what is your favorite Halloween like uh, cereal that's come out because I did I've never actually had like the original like what is it there's like uh what are the original ones there's like the Count Chocula then there's the pink one the, the uh I can't remember what it is there's like the th there's the three original ones which I see that they brought back this year which I have not tried but what's your favorite have you tried any of these what's your favorite of these uh have you not tried them? Are you going to try them? Uh, did my review help decide whether you're going to try it or not? Uh, let me know in the comments below, guys. I love talking about this kind of stuff, especially this Halloween-related uh, stuff. You guys are amazing. And all, you guys are amazing. I can't talk today. You guys are amazing as always. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.